this old Beckett Mini here. Got a little something that's uh, very different for a box break video. It's a uh, something from overseas from Japan, a charity based product uh, from Brothers Inc. And uh, it's kind of a high end brand. I'll go and show off a sample box here 2013 World Stars Tarika Edition. And what this is, is a $200 box with a limited American run that I'll give you details on here shortly. But what they are, are shadow box type cards with autographs on some of the cards. Also memorabilia pieces, I think that one there is an actual game used piece inside the shadow box. And if you can tell from the way they look, some of them are actual gold. Um, Every, basically you have a one in three and four chance of getting a one of one out of this product. And uh, I wanted to show you off a box. Now since this is a limited type of product, literally there are only 10 cases being sold in the U.S. This is mostly a Japan based product from Brothers Inc. Uh, BROG.CO.JP is their website address. Um, but there are 100 10 cases, 120 boxes being sold via blowout cards. So if you go over there, you'll see a sell sheet, which I just showed you actually, and uh, some a price. They're 200 bucks a box. Um, basically, there's four different kinds of cards inside these boxes. A uh, got my cheat sheet here. They're called Koji, which is the shadow box cards. Auto rate, which are signed cards that appear like they're sketches. Some may be, some may not be. I'm not totally sure there. There are sketchographs, which are autograph sketches, and there are relic cards. So four different types of cards. Each box has two or three cards inside, and since it's a limited product, they actually made boxes specifically for us. I opened one off camera, and I'll show these to you shortly after I open this one. Let me get out my trusty blade. <clears throat> much faster that way and uh, there's quite a packaging job on these very very cool okay there's your first glimpse it's got some plastic wrap and each card has a kana message on the printout I have no idea what that says of course I'm not exactly bilingual well, I know a little Spanish so maybe I am bilingual but there are two in this box. There were two in our other box, which I'll show you again here. And I'll go ahead and rip them and show them. Wow, that's interesting. I have a Koji card. Koji, which is a shadow box card, which is actually got a gold frame on it and is signed by Koji Urahara former Rangers pitcher, or he's shown as a Ranger here. So there you go. So that's his autograph on a 24 karat gold card. The, um, the signatures are all done via um, US based agents and such. I'll uh, show you an example of one here shortly. So I think we'll give this card away. So in the comments below, tell us what you think and Koji Uehara's gold autograph shadow box Kana card will be yours. We'll pick someone at random probably November 1st. So there you go. That's card one. Second card in this box. And again, three out of, you have a 75% chance of getting a one of one out of cards. <clears throat> this is odd. Hmm. I guess this is, okay, this is a sample card for us. There's actually a notation on the back of each card saying it's a sample, but to rewind, Brothers Inc. is a uh, Tokyo-based company that is actually making these cards, and these are actually a charity-raising um, uh, product as well. This is from the Brothers Inc. World Stars Series Charity Products line. Each card has a serial number on the back. I want to give away who that is. And this one, actually, because it's a sample box made for Beckett Notes, something that's missing from this card, but I guess it's appropriate that it's a sample. A Mr. Stallone will be signing sometime this month. This product doesn't come out until apparently December, I believe, or the international U.S. version doesn't come out until December. So 
Let me pull this note off, and I will show you what, if it was a full-on actual not sample box, would be a auto rate card of Sylvester Stallone. So the actual cards, when these come out, that would have been signed right there, which is pretty unique because he's a pretty uh, popular guy. This is a metal silver auto rate, so apparently... I don't know if that's actual silver or that's printed on there or not, but there you go. So Koji Urahara in a future signings real card would be signed, Sylvester Stallone card. In our previous pack, we got two different kinds of cards. Um, check my notes here. This is a, let's see, a Koji card type one. Uh, this is an autographed shadow box of Muenori Kawasaki. It's a Canada patch flag laid below the acetate, which has a photograph of a player with the Blue Jays, a Canada flag, and his actual signature on the, the plastic overlay. So I don't know. There's no production run on this. Some of these obviously are have to be one-on-ones. This one does not say that. Um, but this next card... There might be more than one, but it's pretty nice. And as I was talking about autographs, um, Damian Lillard is a Leaf exclusive, so they went out and got Damian Lillard's autograph on the either on the gold piece or the acetate piece. What this is is a 22 karat real gold auto rate card. So it's just like the Stallone, but this is on actual gold. Not very heavy; it's just gold leaf as the action pack days. But uh, actual Lillard signature and an actual gold card, so high end. So one box, Beckett sample boxes had these two cards, both signed by the players. The other sample box that I just opened has the Koji Urahara, which could be yours if you tell us what you think of a product like this in the comments below. Obviously, it's not a not a licensed product, but it's a kind of a high end deluxe feeling product for sure. And of course. Here is the Sylvester Stallone to be signed in the future if it was a real box, which is just a sample box for us. Sylvester Stallone. So that was 2013 World Stars Tarika Edition from Brothers Inc. in Tokyo, Japan, a uh, product that will be arriving in the stateside here in December. Blogcards.com will have the details. I'll probably link to their deal below. And uh, let me know what you think. And enter to get yourself a Koji Urahara. So until next time, Chris Olds, Baggy Baseball, just keep ripping.